Welcome to Vericon Online Portal Training. This video is an introduction to the settings page. In the settings page, you are able to create alerts and tags for the system. Our alert system allows email notifications to be sent out if a boiler or a light moves into failed state. When you click on settings, you can see a list of all the alerts which have been set up within the portal. This allows you, for example, to set up instant notification for your engineer by email if a boiler or light goes into failed condition and needs repair. In this example, if an error code is raised by a boiler because of going into failed state, an email will be sent to the relevant engineer as notification immediately, and the manager will also receive an email if the boiler remains in failed condition three days later. The alerts function works in the same way for boilers and emergency lights. These timings can be set in the most convenient way for your operation and there is no limit to the number of emails which can be set up. In this example, you will see that an email has also been set up for when an asset is returned to OK condition or for boilers requiring preventative maintenance or which have been marked as repaired equipment. Now let us add a new alert. Click Add to set up a new alert. Alerts are filtered according to any tags which you have set up within your portal and may be set up either in minutes, hours or days after the event which acts as a trigger. I will set up an alert using the default tag. Here I will choose days and enter 7. And I will set up the trigger condition using device status and failed equipment. Next I will enter the email address where I want the notification to be sent and I will select email. By pressing the green tick, I have saved this alert and it now appears in the list. In this example, I have therefore set up an escalation email, which informs the manager if the boiler already in failed condition still remains in failed condition seven days after the original fault. In this alerts page, there is no limit to the number of emails which can be set up or a restriction on the email addresses which can be used. Meanwhile, since the alerts function works in the same way for boilers and emergency lights, it is possible to set up the same pattern of alerts for Emirate devices reporting failed equipment. Alerts can be set up with a default tag or alternative tags may also be set up such as this tag for boilers, so that alerts are filtered according to a certain criteria. To set up a tag, click this tab at the top of the page. Click Add and enter the name for your tag. In this example, I will set up a tag for Emirate devices so that any alert relating to emergency lighting is not sent to a boiler engineer click the green tick to create the tag. Now if I return to alerts, as you can see here, you follow the same procedure. And this time I will set up the email address for a lighting engineer. In the info page for both Emirates and boilers, it is easy to add a tag to an existing device. For example, if I click here to return to emergency lights and select any device, I can add any tag to this light. So I will tag this one as Emirates, which is the tag I have just set up. Tags can also be added in bulk by selecting boilers or lights from a system view. Click to select all 
and in actions you can add a tag like this which means I have tagged all of these devices as Emered. I can check this by selecting edit columns and dragging across the tags option into my system view. When I press apply you can see that all of the devices have now been tagged as Emered. Thank you for watching. If you have any further queries, please check our library of videos in the support tab or contact us using the address on the screen, customer.success at vericonsystems.com.